Today we're going to talk about another moment of family discipleship, bedtime. What does the bedtime routine look like in your home? Ours can be chaotic. It depends on the time of the year, the day of the week, and the emotions of all involved. How can we lean in at bedtime and use it for discipleship? That's what we're going to talk about today on Fridays Are For Families. Welcome to another episode of Fridays Are For Families, where we seek to empower and equip you to grow as a disciple and disciple maker of Jesus Christ. Bedtime. It's something that happens literally every single day. Well, at least we hope it does. Uh, there are a few things more routine than bedtime in the life of your kid. So how are we utilizing that routine for discipleship? I'll confess that we don't always do this one well. When it's been a late night and we're getting home late, so we've got kids who don't listen well, who are on edge emotionally, who seem to have forgotten how to walk without tripping or running into walls, and who are all of a sudden hungry. It can be a lot. <clears throat> Honestly, it can be overwhelming. But there are some non-negotiables that we have wired into our bedtime regardless of what time it is. My daughters might argue about what those non-negotiables are. They probably consider a bedtime snack and reading books as that. But as our parents, our non-negotiables are, are these two things, particularly singing and praying. Now, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and The Wheels on the Bus aren't exactly discipleship songs, but prime, trying to sing some good songs about God is something we do try to do each night, like God is So Big, or Joshua Fought the Battle of Jericho, or Only a Boy Named David, or even Zacchaeus Was a Wee Little Man. The other non-negotiable is praying with and for our kids. Each night we pray with them for their salvation and for God's plan for their lives. We try to pray for others in need in our community and around the world. These are little things, but as we pray together, our kids are picking up an understanding of what prayer is, of how to do it, of the importance of it. They see our consistency. They hear our faith in God, and they grow in their understanding that God cares about the small details of our lives. Again, we aren't perfect, but we try to work in these non-negotiable elements each night as a way to maximize these moments together. This is where our faith is not just taught, but caught. So thanks for joining us for this week's Fridays Are For Families episode. If you have any specific requests for information you would like to hear more about, uh, we invite you to share them with us, either commenting on this video on YouTube or Facebook, or by emailing us at family at lifeapathway.com. We'll see you next week.